Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to build your own lift bag for diving and of course you got to bring your treasure up somehow. So for our materials you'll need a vinyl seed bag, a garbage bag that's either bigger or the same size, and we've got two straps, one long and one short. So here I've just uh, taken the strap and tucked it into the little fold in the seed bag and I'm gonna bring that up to sew it in later. So I've got the vinyl seed bag and I'm gonna actually roll the ends over the garbage bag and then sew all the way around it. Now here you can see I've mocked it all up with duct tape and I'm just gonna sew right over the duct tape and get it all sealed up. So as you can see I just sewed that seam around the bottom and I'm not a professional seamstress so you can mock all this up and have it ready and bring it into a professional and they'll actually make it look good. So I also sewed the top seam up and sewed in the little handle. I've sewed up the bottom of the bag now and I put the strap along the bottom seam there. So I left a hole for the air. As you fill the bag up with air and it, at depth and it goes up to the top, it's gonna expand and the air is gonna come out the bottom if it gets too big so it won't pop. Uh, here I've sewn the main strap onto the bottom of the bag. And I put it between the seam and just sewed right across. There's probably about six inches there. And uh, that'll be our main strap for what we're bringing up. Now the lift bag's all done, I'll show you how to use it. So we're going to take our strap, tie it onto our treasure, and we're going to take our octo and put it in the hole, fill it up with air. It's going to lift up and you're going to want to go slow. You don't want it to just take off because that can be dangerous and you definitely don't want to be attached to it. So as the bag comes up from depth, it's going to get bigger and as it gets to the top, sometimes it'll even shoot out of the water because it's got so much air in it. It's uh, an uncontrolled ascent if you're attached to it. You're going to want to make sure you're not underneath it too, just in case whatever you have on is too heavy or the strap breaks or the bag might just lose air and you don't want that coming down on you. So make sure you use your Octo and keep an eye on your air supply because you can get carried away sometimes and uh, not realize that you're running out of air because you're putting it all in the bag. So just make sure you can get to the top safely. And I hope you enjoyed my video on how to make a lift bag. Happy treasure hunting guys. Be safe.